case, I have a confession. I... How do I say this? <clears throat> I, uh... I love Lanky Box. <clears throat> well, now that that's out of the way, I thought that I should give my expert opinion on some Lanky Box drama. A bunch of YouTubers have been making videos on them recently for one specific reason. Stealing thumbnails. Seeing as I am someone that they've personally stole like 10 thumbnails from in the past two months, I think I could give my expert opinion. Okay, here it is. This Roblox YouTuber got exposed. Firstly, what's with this thumbnail? They didn't apologize. I don't think they ever would apologize either. Guys, shh, guys! So recently, a Roblox YouTuber got exposed. Yes. Exposed for stealing some of my thumbnails. Yeah, some of your thumbnails. I think they've stolen, like, some of everyone's thumbnails. And, well, that person is LankyBox. Yes, LankyBox. Hold on a minute. This isn't a hate video. I'm not mad at them. I'm not... You're not mad at them. I'm mad at them! I'm not here to expose them. I've just seen a lot of people on Twitter talking about this. That actually reminds me. There's actually this thread on Twitter, which basically goes through almost every thumbnail they've ever stolen. LankyBox is even copying gaming with Kev's thumbnails. Normally, it's the other way around. Around. Look, I'm even in this, copying my thumbnails. This one specifically, they literally just stole it and then put their face on the side. You can't do that. For the last four <laughs> years, LankyBox has been directly stealing hundreds of thumbnails from YouTubers in the Roblox community with zero remorse whatsoever. Yeah, zero remorse. That's the thing. I don't think they even know. So I actually made this video a while ago. What if Floppa raised you? So it looks like this, right? Pretty simple. And then I noticed a few days later, LankyBox released this. They didn't just copy it, right? They literally just cut out this part and the poop part and then stuck it on their own. But my thumbnail maker was upset about that as well. So he actually got in contact with LankyBox and told me that they have a team who handles everything. So LankyBox probably doesn't even realize Realize they're copying. Feeling from Flamingo, Dennis, Sketch, Creecraft, and even gaming with Kev. These guys upload several times a day. That's the thing. They upload like a billion videos a day, so there's no way they can keep track of it. On the other hand, if you get a post that much, that's your choice. You know, you have a choice to upload that often. If you're gonna sit down and say, I'm gonna upload seven videos a day, you should also be thinking, I'm gonna check seven videos thumbnails a day and make sure I'm not stealing anyone else's work. Sometimes <laughs> Lanky Box will get more views than the original yeah that's the thing he they actually do get more views that's probably the main thing that upsets me about this and some of the videos that they've stolen like this one here i got 1 million views they got 1.2 million views and uh this one look at it it's the exact same idea me running you got the guy falling through the back and i got 1 million views they got 3.6 million views which i mean makes sense because they've got almost 10 times more subscribers than me but when this happens anyone that clicks on their thumbnail like if i get recommended to someone who's already watched lanky box thumbnail they're gonna think oh i've already seen this video and then not click on mine there's one particular video they made now i have this make a wish video all right <laughs> It's the exact same! Clearly, they don't read the comments because their whole comment section, almost every second comment is about them stealing my thumbnail. Let me show you some examples. Here's an example of a sketch thumbnail that they stole. This one was one year ago, and this one was 12. Wait, 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 wait. I think I know what they did here. I think they thought sketch was the actual NPC in the game. But, you know, what's impressive is... They literally use two different angles, so they would have had to remake sketches, like, as effort. Here's one they stole from Dennis. They're literally almost the exact- Okay, yeah, they, they ripped that up from Dennis as well. Like, that's- Come on, my man. Dennis's thumbnails are amazing, by the way. I'm pretty sure Flebsy makes these thumbnails, which is another YouTuber. He's so talented. I don't know about other people, but when I plan out my thumbnails, I usually sketch them out first, and then I go and check if anyone else has made a similar one, just to make sure I'm not copying them from the start. Now, I don't think they do that. I think they just have a thumbnail designer that literally just Googles the game or searches in YouTube, and then they just pick whichever one looks good and just copy-paste or, you know, remake it, which isn't right, but I don't think it's Lucky Box directly doing that. Of course, it is their responsibility as to what their employees do. But most of the time, the YouTubers don't even know what's going on. In fact, I guarantee Lanky Box probably doesn't even know about all of this. They've Creecraft is cutting them some slack. I don't even think they know that they're copying people, let alone care. If I ever do something wrong, by all means, tweet about it. Because at the end of the day, that's really the only way. Okay, Creecraft. 
if you ever do something wrong. In that case, let me just type. No, okay, no, guys, this is a joke. I don't actually care. <laughs> he copy pasted a floppa out of my thumbnail. I only know this because one of my friends said it to me and asked if I cared. Yeah, I just think that's kind of funny. But anyways, but yes, I agree. I think we shouldn't hate on Lanky Box. Okay, let's see what Dennis had to say about this. I know Dennis made a video on Lanky Box as well, a little after Creecraft. Yeah, this one. Bro, look at this thumbnail. <laughs> He does not look happy. Ow. Wait. I'm reacting to Dennis, reacting to Creecraft, reacting to the other guy? What is going on right now? <laughs> did we, wait, he found someone that actually copies Lanky Box? I did not know that was possible. So I guess Dennis is pointing out another point, which is a lot of YouTubers seem to copy each other's. It's not just Lanky Box. So Lanky Box shouldn't be the only ones getting hate, but they're definitely like the most capable of affording to pay someone to check. There are a lot of YouTubers that copy other YouTubers and they just get away with it. I agree with everything Creek is saying here. Everything he's saying is true. YouTubers have a team and they have thumbnail yeah. artists. The, the, the YouTubers often aren't the ones actually doing it themselves. Creek is a sweet boy. I very much <laughs> <laughs> admire his a positive influence. I'm gonna take- a Wait, why is Yashi doing down there? Someone called the bruh. Is he safe? Dennis, can you please confirm if Yashi is safe right now? What is, what is he doing down there? More of an uh, uh, aggressive approach. Ah, Dennis is gonna be aggressive. Okay, I am excited. I've never seen aggressive Dennis before. That I think he's going a little bit too easy on them. Lanky box very well could have dozens of employees. And Creek is almost certainly right that Lanky Box probably, they wake up, they immediately have everything prepared in front of them to record that day. They just bang, 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 bang right through it. And then they send it all off and their team takes care of it. They don't need to worry about it. They probably barely are looking at their own uploads, thumbnails and whatever, it's true. But that is simply not an excuse. Like, you know, any other business, which is what they are, they're, they're a business now. And any other business, if they copied a competitor, they would not get away with that. Like that would be all over the news. They would be in so much trouble, but it seems like Lanky Box just gets away with this. And like, not only gets away with it, they seem to be awarded for it. Weren't they nominated for an award at Roblox recently? Their innovation awards or something? They were literally nominated by Roblox <laughs> to become video star. If the reason they're this big is from stealing other people's hard work? Why should they get an award for it? I guarantee you Lanky Box probably doesn't even know about all of this. They've probably seen none of these tweets, none of these videos, not. They probably don't even get on Twitter. Either enough money where they don't do the absolute bare minimum work or say they are being sufficiently paid, get better employees that aren't lazy enough that they're just gonna play drunk. Ah! The roast! He's right though. I wonder if Lanky Box gave the employees the okay, you know? Like, surely the employees have to be trained by someone, right? So what if Lanky Box actually trained the employees and just said to them, oh, you know, just just Google the, just, just search on YouTube and then see what everyone else has done and just copy it. What if they said that? We'll never really know. Rice. And at the end of the day, it is the CEO, the overseer, it is their responsibility to make sure that their workers are doing the right thing. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying. That's what I just said. Thank you, Dennis. Yes. Okay, yeah, I pretty much agree with uh, Dennis. I, I think they should have more responsibility. And uh, <laughs> free, yeah, free Yoshi. I agree with that as well.